How do you tell if a fraction is terminating or repeating? Well, here's the way most people do it, and then I'll show you an easier way. You could just take and divide one by seven and then three by five in a calculator. Three divided by five, that equals 0 0.6, and that's it, it ends. So this is definitely terminating. But if you divide one by seven, here's what your calculator shows you. And it's kind of hard to tell. It looks like it might just keep going. But actually, this is a repeating fraction. So if you did the division longhand, eventually you'd see these numbers right here, they repeat. And then we start back out at one again, one, four, two, eight, five, seven, one, four, two, eight, five, seven. It just keeps going. So you could write this like this, but that's all quite a bit of work. So here's an easier way to do it. First, the fraction should be simplified. It's already in simplest terms here. Then if this number, the prime factors here are two or five or two and five, it's going to terminate. So we have our five here that terminates. How about one seventh? For one seventh, the prime factors of seven, it's just seven here, right? Not two and or five. So this here, it's gonna be a repeating fraction, just like we found. Let's try another one. What do you think about this one? So we're gonna look at 27. So this would equal four over three times nine. That's the same thing. We could then call it four over three times three times three, and you can see our only prime factor is three, not two, not five. So this is going to repeat. How about this one? A little bit harder. Is 7 fourths repeating or terminating? So we have an even number, but that doesn't really tell us for sure. Let's write out the prime factors. So two times three, that's six. Three times three, that's nine. So we do have a two, but we have these threes here. So if we have a three, remember we can only have two or five as our prime factors. So this has to be a repeating fraction, even though we have an even number. Let's try one last one. Three sixty-fourths, repeating or terminating? Look at all those twos. That means this is a terminating fraction. It's Dr. B. And thanks for watching.